सो वॉट इज़ अब एवरी वन दिस इज़ करन हीर वेलकम बैक टू टेक करन यूट्यूब चैनल मी यू आई ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव ट्वेंटी वन पॉइंट वन पॉइंट ट्वेल्व द नाइटली चाइना नाइटली चाइना क्लोज बेटा वर्जन ऑफिशली नाउ अवेलेबल फॉर द रेडमी नोट एट यूजर्स मी यू आई ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव एंड ऑल्सो द बेस्ट पार्ट इज इट्स बेस्ड ऑन एंड वर्जन इलेवन इट वॉज वन ऑफ द थिंग्स विच विच इज मोस्ट अवेटेड we finally got it android version 11 based the latest china beta update which is available for the redmi note 8 users if you are a redmi note 8 users just go for it and you can install this but the thing is this is released in china so it's available as a recovery room if you have unlocked bootloader if you have a custom recovery you can install this build right now i'm not going to show the installation because this is just a zip file the boot into custom recovery install the zip and done you are good to go so we are going to talk take a look at this miui 12.5 update which is now officially available for the redmi note 8 user everything is same just android version 11 and miui 12.5 first look is already available make sure to watch this video till the end let's get started guys the default look as expectedly it's same with the all the miui 12.5 builds and miui 12.5 i have a video for a lot of devices like redmi note 9 pro already got the miui 12.5 android version 11 not officially but as a port room it's available for redmi note 8 it's already available as a port room but based on android version 10 based on android version 11 now it's officially available as you can see the china beta you can wait for 2 or 3 days maximum you will see the xiaomi eu build will also come for this device. is based on android version 11 the mi 12 based on android version 11 was quite good but i got some issues there i don't think so those issues will be available in this build but if it is still available then this kind of thing is very bad the thing is we have the latest security patch of 1st of january 2021 so this seems to be really nice here going for the other things let's talk about the power menu it's i think not changed Yes, you can see no power menu changed. Even it's MIUI 12.5, even it's Android version 11. The power menu is still the same. I don't know why, but yes, it is. But yes, we have the new kind of volume bar available here. The new power menu is not available. We need to think about that wallpaper and personalization. Same kind of things which you get in the MIUI 12.5 version, where we have this new kind of section available. We have the ringtones, notification, alarm option available. If you move into ring you will see all these things available we have identify services and other wallpapers have the nature patterns liquid colors dynamic nebula geometry mount shining and some chinese wallpaper apps all the things are same here like the miui 12.5 expectedly no super wallpapers because those are not supported here and also not able to we have the option of customizing the fonts boldness or whatever else you want to do for it this is china beta so a lot of chinese shit available here lock screen also include the same kind of feature display charging animation after devices unlocked the option is available here too going for the display options new kind of option light mode dark mode as expectedly available here full screen mode etc same here going for the sound and vibration same thing there is a new ui we already know that you get these kind of options in the miui 12.5 5 if you are looking for the mi 12.5 first look i have a video on that make sure to check out that sound assistant seems to be same here adjust sound adjust media sound in multiple apps this is a very interesting feature which you get in android version 11 most of the cases we have all other things are same here which are available in miui 12 by the way same kind of things in miui 12.5 just the new ui which you already know that some things you get here notifications and control center like control center style we have the new version control center options available let's take Look at the control center. Okay, it's not changed. Okay, once again, let's try this time. Okay, now it's worked. We have new control center. Expectedly, it's working fine here. And let's wait for some time if it will work or not. We have smart home option available. Items shown lock screen and status bar related things. Same kind of things which you get in the China beta as always are same here. Home screen has the same kind of option. Now we have the system navigation option available here. And yes, we have the full screen indicator option available. The new gesture. are available here and working fine i think so yes these are fine here floating windows option is available here too 
let's say let's change it to let's see in the layout this one is horizontal and this one is vertical so yes horizontally available here too that's kind of really good icon style you can customize by going into here we have other custom icon packs available if you want to you can simply move on to more icons and you'll be redirected to the theme store and here you'll see a lot of icons if you can customize that's kind of really good you can customize the icon size also it's up to you if you want to enable the custom size then it's up to you we have other cool kind of options available home screen and etc etc password security same kind of things fingerprint face lock etc available here privacy protection new privacy protection app option available battery usage is also something interesting a new one additional settings has same data and time languages and input enterprise mode and same here we have the me ai wallet and payments option available now of course this is not for the other other users like the if you are from other country like you're not from china then it will not be available for you i am using i am using it in india and i don't think so that will work but we have never tried it yet by the way special features include the same kind of things looking for the game turbo let's take a look new kind of ui option available here click on agree you'll see can't connect to network okay let's wait and reload it once again and we have something new ui here let's find out if it is working fine or not first time opening here yes it's looking cool game turbo in game shortcuts uninstall game home screen shortcuts and here we have the performance edited things me land speed boost and only these four things available game dnt only these options you get in the game turbo nothing else is here and that was expected it also they don't give redmi uh, they don't give extra features to the redmi note 8 users we already know other things are same here right now the ui seems to be really cool and smooth here but it's just the first time i have installed this build on my redmi note 8 so not sure about that talking about the camera if we get any kind of features or not we need to take a look at for some other time for some time to check out the things which we get here portrait mode etc more has the same kind of ui it is a new kind of ui we already know night 48 megapixel and other things are same here these are the things i just wanted to let you know this is a new build which you can go and install this if you're looking for what is new and what is not we're gonna wait for some time i'm gonna shift you the link for this build in the description so you can go and download this build right now on your device and if you have a custom recovery unlocked bootloader loader you can install this latest official miui 12.5 based on android version 11 this is all from today's video i hope you like this if you like this don't forget to like and share this video if you're new here don't forget to subscribe me thanks for watching and goodbye